So some people asked for a tutorial on how I did my Hedda McNamara hairdo. So here it is. Um, enjoy. I've just taken a shower and let my hair dry naturally. And now I'm starting off with brushing my hair. And after brushing my hair I'm grabbing a stand of hair and I'm just twisting it from up to down. Like in this video. And when it's twisted, you roll it up on top of your head, head like a bun. And secure your bun with an elastic band. And I'm moving to the camera so you can see it from close up. So, yeah, this is what I'm doing. Fabulous. Rolling it up again. Uh, yeah, do this with your entire hair. So I've had those bun thingies in for a couple of hours. And I'm going to take them out and see, see what it will have done. So that's one, and I just it apart with my fingers to get the tangles out. That's one. Yeah, I will just remove those and come back later. Wow. Special. Not. Hair brush gently, not really brushing, just um, you don't really need to brush, but on the top of your hair, make it a bit smoother. You know what I mean? Just pat over your hair, not in your hair. Now, I'm going to brush my hair backwards so my uh, barter moves naturally in the middle, is going to the side. There are special brushes for that, but my hair is quite easy with this, so I just use a regular brush. Because I've got thick hair and those thin brushes don't get stuck. <laughs> it totally depends on your hair and your personal preference how you do this. The way I do it is really uncommon, but it works for me. Now I am... Um, going to crap a lock of hair got it and hold it brush it up in the wrong direction so up and do the same here. On the hair and leaving a bit of air between your skull and the hair. And it doesn't look right. Also twist it a bit. 
but there's not enough air between, so I just pull this up. Interesting. I think I've got a he bad hair day for this look. Maybe it's because of the heat, but it really is better the first time doing this. Okay, now bobby pins. I'm putting one from beneath up and one from the top going down. So they cross each other and form a little um, X. So, and going for Hannah McNamara, you need a yellow bow. So put that over there. And probably if you have thin hair, you can just apply the bow. You don't need the bobby pins, but my hair is too thick for just a clip of the bow. It won't go over. So that's why I use the bobby pins first, and it's more secure. And well, it's the head of McNamara hair tutorial. Hope you liked it. And after I've done my hair, I can apply my makeup. So, yeah. You probably could do the makeup first, but I prefer to do my hair first because my hair is like over in my face, and then I've got makeup in my hair. and. Yeah, it's not good. But do whatever you prefer. So, um, let me know what you thought of it. And I hope it helped. And let me see what you can do with this, or if you give it your own inspiration. It's, yeah, this is my own version of Heather McNamara. It's not really based on either the musical or the movie. So, yeah, um, that's it. Bye. <laughs>